Hey everybody, in this episode of Active Learning we're going to look at a technique called Team Quizzes. I call it Pub Quizzes really though. Simple technique, you divide the class in half, Group 1 and Group 2. Group 1 creates 15 questions for Group 2, and Group 2 creates 15 questions for Group 1. You do it like a pub quiz you set up at start, question 1 for Group 1. You ask them the questions, the questions have to be on the material you've covered over the year. So this can be really effective at the end of the year. Each group, you give them a few days to create the questions and they'll try and think of very fiendish, very tricky little questions about the material. So what you're really getting them to do is create 10, 15 or 20 questions about the topic. It's looking like it's a competition, but in reality they're going to study the material very carefully, try and find little tricky questions to ask the other team. Yes, you do a, a, a quiz at the end, so you say, group one, question one whatever group two gave them. Group two, question one, group one, question two, group two, question two, group one, question three, group two, question three, and so on. You mark the two sets of answers, you give a bag of sweets to whichever team wins, and you give a bag of sweets to whichever team loses as well. It's a really, really effective way of getting them to explore the material in a lot of detail. And the questions can be usually very well thought out. I typically give them some instruction like, it can't be a question about something on a slide. It has, the topic has to cover at least two or three slides within my material. But it's a really, really effective way. Creating a bit of competition can be effective in that way. So thanks very much. We'll see you on the next episode.